Welcome to Movie Maker. I'm going to show you how you edit a video and how you use Movie Maker simply. It's quite a simple program, really. Uh, not expensive. What you need to do, take your uh, video clip that you want to take. This is where I uh, <coughs> talk about how you um, <coughs> how you uh, make a thumbnail, but I don't want to make uh, make this uh, uh, because I I will do uh, something else. I'm going to bring up an old uh, video that I have uh, uploaded before and just show it show it to you. Uh, let's see. Uh, yeah. Uh, let's go. Where is Skyblock? Sky, okay, 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 because I have, uh, for example, this one, the lag. Um, <coughs> the first you're going to look is uh, Movie Maker is trying to load this. Um, I don't. I, I want something that I preloaded, so I can just show you how you can do other stuff with it. So if you stop here, stop it. And I should be. Oh well, I'm gonna use the clip thumbnails because I preloaded it before. And the, f the thing you can do is, uh, for example, you can go into video editing and you can increase the speed of the video. This way, you can make a time lapse. Uh, and and you, as you see, here goes much faster through the. This is a preview window, and uh, yeah, you you should remember this part of yeah, and then we could even go faster. So, for example, much faster. But this window can lag sometimes, uh, and when you render the video, it actually goes much much faster. And uh, yeah, so what you could do, let's just. Re uh, Take it back. You could even make it slower, but oh well. Uh, what you like might be like to do is uh, have in a text or something like a title. Because uh, if you uh, press the title, you get a, a bit of a screen before, and then you can uh, set up the time limit on how long this is going to show. Now it's on uh, set on seven minutes, and it shows um, this. Um, let's just edit this to. Um, hello. Oh, hello. Uh, hello world. And um, what you could do is go in here, change it to something else. So you see, it actually looks different. You could uh, make the text go different size, fat, curved, and then the color whatever you like since it's a black background the white is best this is the and it, this is just to make the size uh, jump and then this is the size more consistently this is uh, like board you should know it uh, if you know how to do word and what you could do with the text is uh, you could have it fade in or just be there or like you just stretch in Rotate in, um, and uh, I have this. Uh, don't really know what it does uh, when it exits thing. Yeah, it spins what? out. Yeah, uh, and then uh, let's go back to the text format. This one uh, slides it in. Uh, this one slides it out. This one it, it goes up. This one turns it up. Yeah. And this one expands, right? Yeah. I usually like to do this one or the spinning one. It depends on how you like it. Um, for example, you could have an image here instead of the black background if you like. And then. Um, for example, if we find uh, 
here for example I want a note here to everyone that's watching that maybe not hearing everything uh, I want text to say <coughs> um, for HD 10 80 P do do um, with uh, do the uh, do uh, uh, one uh, 19 by 20 1920 uh, by uh, 1080 for example and oh the text is not in the right color select it all oh yeah I want it to be black now everyone should be able to see it uh, no I don't want it there I yeah I, I want to move it for example I want it there so you see it better so yeah and then now it's going to be there for seven oh, seconds uh, so I'm just going to and also something you can do is go into video volume and off it goes so you don't hear it if you like just to watch if this works or not for HD and then there, there it goes um, but I, I I would like to have a different format so I like it to fade in and out. Oh yeah, fade in out. So yeah, when it goes to the point when it's going to go out, it's going to fade out. Hopefully, yeah. So it doesn't look too ugly. And uh, yeah. And then um, there's another way you could do this. Uh, for example, if I was digital dialing um right here i could just go into video editing and separate it this tool here separates it now this is two clips for example i could find the other point where i stopped uh, doodling around and was a derp say or just wanted to show you a quick way let's see uh, right here, right there, maybe right there. We take this middle part and speed it up. For example, 16 times. So that when we are here, you watch it. Um, let's just speed it forward. Coming here. Goes faster and faster. Like fast. Through all this stuff that doesn't matter. And then, uh, yeah, on you go back to normal. And if you like, you could even go into uh, animations. For example, I want to animate it in when I do. Um, for example, I like to use pixelating so that it looks pixelated. But I need to find it. Uh, where are you? Um, there we are. For example, now and it goes in. And I want a music clip in here, so I'm going to be quick about this. Uh, so I store a, a lot of clip, uh, like say uh, I have made a new, like, like a bit of a music that I raw this test. It's not long, but you see, it's longer than the actual clip itself. So. What you could do is uh, um, just uh, watch how long the clip is uh, when it starts and you can click here and you see where the end is uh, um, so it's, it's 2 uh, 21 23 and here it is 35 43 so if we take this, uh, go to music part, uh, and then you locate the end part, or you could just scale it down until you feel it's satisfying, like at the end of the clip. Uh, so it's right about here, so that now 
I can do uh, you can tune in and tune out I like to tune out to tune in and tune out lo um, like slowly so that when you go from here let's see yeah for example all right it's not bad and then it's back to it so yeah um if you like to turn back uh, the volume just do this volume say say my volume here is too loud and then um i could always just turn it down what i like to do is usually have the watermark uh, yeah i turn it down a bit size it up in we, a fair it, bit. if it's too low then go on the edge i just increase it just smoothen out the sharp edge so yeah um that's it so when you're done just go in and then um, you can save your project but then you should uh, save your uh, clip and then uh, for you that doesn't have this uh, i have uh, saved as an inst uh, like a preset for fps uh, like 1080 60 frames per second fps so for example if for you to do this uh, um if you just go and uh, go to the bottom of it and press uh, <coughs> create uh, create um, a new profile maybe but the uh, the the one with the star uh, on the bottom one and then click it uh, and you get um, uh, you you just tape tape take whatever you name you like I'm going to do a tutorial and then 1080p and then uh, 60 frames FPS for example and uh, I want it to be 1080 so first you're gonna to have to do uh, 19 by 20 and then um, yeah fuck I should have turned that off but oh well um, and then you have to have um, the height on uh, by 1080 bit 1080 so there we go have 1080p but uh, and then the f <coughs> how fast this b uh, bitrate is you can le usually leave it uh, but uh, if you're not sure let's go for HD uh, screens uh, and then uh, and then uh, no wait um, Uh, yeah, you can go for the HD screen and then just uh, redo the name tutorial 1080p. Sorry, but I need to do this up again. FPS. And then you have the, um, the actual size right. Uh, then you want just to put in 60p, 60 frames per second, and then the bitrate can be that. Uh, it's okay. And then leave the um, sound thing alone. It knows what's what's best. So you, and then just save. And then uh, just save it here. And then uh, close it. And then you done it. And then you can just uh, s um, save the clip as this. And then it, you're done. So that's it. that's been it for today. Have a nice day. And if this has been helpful, but. Press the like button and if you like this tutorial and haven't subscribed already, do think of subscribing. I'm getting quite dry in my mouth. So I'll see you in another video. This has been the second tutorial. So, well, the first on Movie Maker. But that is it. Bye.